Music Box friends, we are very excited that finally Farm Songs Concert Plan is in Music Box. So I just want to give you a little sneak preview if you've ordered um, other concert plans like the Songs of the Sea or the Mountain Plan, you'll be familiar with the kind of format and certainly for everyone in any concert plan that you have if something's missing or there's something special about your particular venue or group of children you just go to forum and click ask lynn questions and i'm happy to help you with your particular setting i print out the concert plan so here it is farm songs and the first thing is just the overview for some of you that have got the concert plans from the past, you already have this type of um, introduction to doing a concert, but I think this will be really, really helpful for new teachers because it really gives you the timeline, plan ahead, and the things to consider, such as if you're using ORF instruments, consider the keys that you're using. Um, would you like a theme? And perhaps using some songs that are very familiar, like the hello and goodbye as part of your concert. So the first thing we have is the concert plan for three groups. Now this can be, um, if you have a concert with one class, you could divide them into three, or if you have um, six classes, you could, you could have your group be two classes each doing this um, concert plan. And you'll have one master plan that will be for the director. So this is for the teacher to get an overview of where you're headed for each class, what you're doing. And the grid will be for you to very easily see what they're doing at the concert each group of children then it's broken down in the detail and this is what's really going to help you with your weekly lesson plan this detail plan will show you week after week what your goals are for that specific uh, for that specific group of children the thing that i really like to do with our concerts is for all children to learn all songs but they have something to do, whether it's the motions, um, maybe they're being featured on solos or they have an unpitched instrument. So you'll see the detail for the specific classes, but again, they will all be learning all of the songs. Then we have the concert songs as a um, lyric sheet. And this is very helpful for your classroom teachers. Uh, parents really enjoy hearing, uh, seeing what the words are from what they're hearing at home. <laughs> and sometimes our little guys sing kind of their own version of the words. So this is really, parents really enjoy getting the lyric sheet at home. So this is all the songs that are in the show. And then your document that you can make your own changes for your concert program. Maybe you're an elementary teacher or you have pre-K or kindergarten students and you would like to include ORF. So this is a concert plan for four groups. So if you would like to have them at the ORF, there's all kinds of ideas. Again, you'll have your director's list, you'll have your plan for four groups. And then there are some suggestions for those of you who might want to include a song in Spanish. And La Granja de Mateo is just a wonderful song to add to this theme and they learn their, their colors, um, animals, counting. And that is a document that is in Music Box downloads that's very easy for you to add to this concert. Here are the visuals for some of the songs. It highlights some solos um, that children can hold up the pictures or certainly you could use puppets as well. So lots of options here for using some fun visuals that will be in the back. And that's the summary of Farm Songs. Again, you know where to go. If you have any questions, just click Forum, ask them questions, and I'll see you in the box.